Hey parents, and welcome to our weekly Highland video for this week. It's been a few weeks since I've been in front of the camera, so I just have a couple of quick updates I wanna share with you. One is, next week is our term break. So we're ending our third term and starting our fourth term. Parents, you can expect report cards to be published on Friday afternoon, and so look for those in your inbox sometime between one o'clock and two o'clock p.m. where you get report card grades for all students within the school. This week, also Wednesday and Thursday, is our academic fair for middle school. Very excited to be sharing with you some of the great things our middle school students have been working on. And we're gonna hear from one of our middle school students in just a moment, uh, who will share a little bit about the academic fair this week. And finally, so excited to share with you the news that our SMR girls basketball team won the city championship on Saturday. Uh, it was such a privilege to host that tournament. We had four teams, including our own, on campus on Saturday. Our girls did a fantastic job winning their morning game against LV and then the championship game against Santa Laurentia. Join me in congratulating our grade 10, 11, and 12 basketball players uh, on a well-earned victory after a great season. So congratulations to players and coaches. Join me in celebrating uh, with them this wonderful victory for our school. And I believe it is the very first SMA basketball banner we have ever won as a school. So really proud of our girls. Parents, today I'm excited to be joined by a special guest. One of our grade six students, Kiyomi, is joining me to talk about our upcoming academic fair for middle school. And Kiyomi is an expert in our academic fair. So she's gonna share some information about the fair in general, and then some information specifically about what she's contributing to the academic fair. So Kiyomi, maybe start by telling us a little bit about what the academic fair is. So the academic fair is, some, is a fair that reviews everything that we've done this term and uh, sharing it to other parents and teachers and students. So why should younger students come to the academic fair? Because they can know at upcoming grades, they can review or uh, listen to what's going to happen when they go up to the next grade. So like our fifth graders can get really excited about what's yeah. coming next for them, right? In sixth grade, yeah. our fourth graders can get really excited about coming up, right? What about parents? Why should parents come? In PTC, they only did those PTCs mm -hmm. only a few times. And in an academic fair, they would see all the things that their uh, kids are us learning in uh, grade six, grade eight, or in their grade. So the parents can learn a lot more about what's going on in our middle school program by coming to the academic fair. So you were telling me before about some of the projects that you've been working on. Can you tell us what you're most excited to showcase? Um, I'm most excited about PE because we are creating a fitness and soccer board game. So, and I've never done anything like this before because usually PE is all about moving, but this is also about a lot of other activities. So you get to showcase some other skills in the PE class, kind of combine it together in a multidisciplinary approach, right? Uh, Kiyomi, how long have you been a student at Espeo Kamung Village? I've been here for, this is my fourth year. Fourth year, and so we started a new middle school, and these academic fairs are some of the things we do differently in our middle school. Uh, what has been like your number one highlight for our middle school this year? What has been the number one thing that you've just been most excited about? The retreat. The retreat. Yeah. Why was the retreat so good for you? The retreat was very fun because we could make more new friends, not even in our grade, mm -hmm. and also uh, seeing other new friends because this, the retreat happened in the start of the year. So you got to build new relationships yeah. at the start of the year and they've lasted throughout the whole year. Yeah. That's beautiful. Uh, Kiyomi, can you tell us when the academic fair is going to happen? Well, grade six is going to happen in Wednesday, mm -hmm. grade eight and grade seven, it's going to happen in Thursday. Right, so Wednesday, March the 6th for grade six, and then Thursday, March the 7th for grade seven and eight. More details will be available in the link below this video. Come and join Kiyomi and all of our other middle school students on those days. And as Kiyomi shared, it's not just about middle school students and parents. This really is an invitation to all of our parents. Come check out what's been going on in our middle school. Come celebrate with our students and teachers what they have been learning in our middle school and celebrate the application of all that they've learned to some very real world projects like making board games and so on. So Kiyomi, thank you so much for helping us out advertising this. Uh, and parents, we really look forward to seeing you on campus on Wednesday and Thursday this week. That's all for this week's highlight video. I hope everybody has a great weekend.